Hey guys, what is up? It is me, Steven, here filming another video for you guys. And this week's video is a haul because I did some fall shopping. So I decided I would probably show you guys what I got because I love clothes and I love fashion and I love making videos. So that's what I'm doing. Um, let's just get right into the video. So the first store I went to was H&M and I was fortunate enough to go to the H&M Balmain collaboration and unfortunately by the time it was like my group's turn to go into the store, everything for guys is pretty much sold out so I only got two t-shirts. These are the two t-shirts that I got. I got the basic white Balmain Los Angeles shirt and the basic black Balmain Los Angeles shirt. I don't know if you could see it on the black one, but um, it's there. They're really nice, basic black and white shirts that pretty much go with everything, and I love them, and yeah. At H&M, I also got this gray knit wool sweater. I don't know what material it is, but it's soft and it's warm, and it's getting cold here in LA, so I need to stay warm. So um, yeah, I got this. I also got this leather black jacket um, and I just figured it's getting cold so I have to stay warm, like I just said. So um, yeah, I got this. Then I also got this mesh burgundy um, t-shirt that is really cool. So yeah, I got that. And then I got these gray black um, biker jeans, they have like the... Um, biker thing. I don't know what this is called, but I got these. I figured like they're very different and cool, so why not? That's all I got from H&M. The next store I went to was Topshop, and I'm not the biggest Topshop fan at all. I honestly don't really like it, but I went in with my friend and I got two t-shirts. They're basic uh, hunter green and beige nude, I guess. I just figured these colors are very in. It's very fall, and I like the way they found me a lot. They make me look skinny. Um, so yeah, I got these, and they're also really cool because at the end, they're like cut off. I don't know what this is called, but it looks like you like took scissors and just cut them. So yeah, I figured these were really cool. So I got them, and they were only $15, which is... Pretty cheap for Topshop, actually. The next item that I'm gonna show you is from a online clothing store called Dime Stop Clothing. They're a smaller online clothing company that is very affordable and it's cool because not a lot of people have their stuff, so you're kind of unique and different when you wear it because it's a smaller company. Um, and basically, here it is. It says generic effing t-shirt with two white stripes on the sleeves and it's long sleeve and um, I just like it. I'm gonna link them in the description below so you can check it out. The next store I went to was Zara and Zara is literally one of my favorite stores. Um, I feel like it's so like high fashion but it's very cheap and affordable to the average person. Um, so I got this flannel because I figured Flannels are very fall, so why not? And it's blue and gray. Blue is my favorite color, and um, I just figured it's can work with a lot of outfits. I can throw a leather jacket over it. I could wear it with black jeans, a Chelsea boots. I just kind of envisioned the outfit when I saw the shirt. So um, yeah, I'm obsessed with this flannel. The next thing I got from Zara are these gray, basic looking tennis shoes, sneakers, whatever you want to call them. And I've been wanting these for such a long time, but the first time I saw them, I was like, Steven, those are really nice, but they're not you. They won't go with any of your clothes. Then I went into Zara on Hollywood Boulevard the other day, and I saw them, and I was like, I'm getting them. I can't believe they still have them. I saw them like three months ago, and um, I just love them. They're like really cool, and they're gray, and they kind of go with a lot of things because they're very neutral, so, um, I just dropped one, but I love them a lot. The next thing I got from Zara are these sweatpants that have tears in the knees and in the butt pocket, and they're just distressed, um, sweatpants that I love a lot, and they're gray, and I've never seen any sweatpants with rips, so I bought them. The next store I went to was Forever 21, and at Forever 21, I'm 
kind of hate Forever 21, but um, I went in and I got a hat. Um, it's a brown hat and it's this like suede material and um, I just like it, so um, I got it. The next store I went to was Sephora and I'm obsessed with like beauty and like be like looking good, if that makes sense. I like skincare and I like all that kind of stuff. So I got a highlighter by Becca in Opal. Um, I'll show you what it looks like. It's so like glowy and it's like, you, you probably can't see it, but you'll be seeing a um, everyday makeup tutorial very soon and I will be using this. So um, look forward to that. The next store I went to was Versace and I probably didn't need this but I bought it anyways and I bought underwear from Versace and I went in there with a friend because he bought a necklace and I was looking around. I did not plan on buying anything but I saw these and I fell in love with them. I was like black and gold what? They have the Versace logo and the design around them so I bought them. It was a very unnecessary thing to buy. Um, would I ever pay this amount of money for underwear again? Probably not. Um, but I bought them, so do I regret buying them? Not really. I do like them. Alright guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for weekly videos, um, follow all my social networks. Those will be in the description below. I love you guys so much. See you next week. Peace out.